Hello, my name is Magnus Peterson, and this is a demonstration of meta optimization of particle swarm optimization. I've just paused the execution, and this small program is made with the SwarmUps source code library for C sharp. I use the C sharp version because it is multi threaded, so I have eight threads running. And just to go through the configuration, uses a Laos meta optimizer with different parameters here. And it is trying to find the best parameters for the particle swarm optimization using when, when PSO is run on 12 different benchmark problems 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. The dimensionality of each benchmark problem is 10, and we are averaging over 64 runs and 20,000 iterations per run. So, what we see here is the parameter for S, the swarm size, omega, phi P, and phi G, I think. And then the meta fitness, which is how well the PSO is scoring on these 12 benchmark problems when using these parameters. The stars mean that it's an improvement, which will become clear in a second, and you should just ignore the one. So let's pause it again. Um, so what we have here is the stars for improvement. The first parameters we tried are an improvement over nothing, obviously. And the second parameters we tried are an improvement as well, because the meta fitness measure is much lower than this one. But then we tried a lot of uh, different parameters, all these parameters out here, and they were worse. So because we're using the technique called preemptive fitness evaluation, we can abort the um, computations and skip to the next parameters. And that's what you're gonna see when the execution takes leaps or uh, some of the executions are rapid and some of them are slow. So the slow ones are the ones where it has to compute everything because it doesn't really know yet if the parameters are better or worse. So let's give it a go. So what you have seen here is one meta optimization run. And the best parameters are the last ones to have the stars. So the best PSO parameters has swarm size S equal to 283 rounded up. The omega is minus 0 0.4403. The phi P is minus 0 0.0. 223 and phi g is 3.7598 and the meta fitness measure that is the score of how well these pso parameters perform on the benchmark problems we have in our settings is 56.14 it is now starting a new meta optimization run and i'm just gonna let it run until the end at which point i have some comments again
This is a new meta optimization run starting again. new run starts again. Notice how some of the executions are fast and some are slow. The ones with the stars are the slow ones because all the optimizations have to be performed to the end for all the benchmark problems. When we discover that it's worse performance, we can abort it, like here. And this is, of course, a new meta optimization run again. The meta fitness is, starts high because it's a random choice of parameters for the PSO. And gradually they improve. This is not perfectly aligned, but you can probably make it out. So now we are down to a Meta fitness of 63.96. We are having a hard time finding a better one, Ooh, slightly better, slightly better. And that's it. So this time use it is includes a couple of pauses that I made. So maybe it was, I don't know, four or five minutes. Um, so it's fairly quick. The best found parameters for the PSO was a swarm size of 93.5. So it's rounded up to 94. The omega was minus 0.44 and so on. And these are very similar to the parameters in the slides from the previous talk. And here we have a list of the 20 best parameters for the PSO that we found. Um, we can see that the swarm size is quite different, so maybe that is not so important. But omega is fairly similar, so minus 0.4 or 0.3, something like that. That seems to work very well. And phi p. That changes a bit as well. We have minus 0.35 here and we have 0.33 here. And the meta fitness is almost the same. So similar per performance, but different parameters um, and so on. So meta optimization is quick and it's easy. And you can uh, adjust the source code, modify the source code. So you can use it with your own optimizer variants or uh, try other configurations. Good luck.